Planet Zoo has just graced us with another two reveals. Welcome back, everyone, to the channel. Hope you guys are all having some of the most wonderful of wonderful days. And my name is Leaf. It's so great to have you guys back over here. So, Planet Zoo the other day just tweeted out the caracal, and already I'm very happy with it. I know that there's some minor kind of quips and uh, qualms with it. Uh, specifically on the tail length and I do agree with that I feel like that tail should be a bit longer and I don't think that's kind of like a angle issue I think that's really just a um just a model issue when it comes to that uh, but otherwise I'm very happy with it the facial markings which are very very important to the animal came out extremely well so I'm super happy with how well that turned out and we also got a reveal at the emu so yeah we actually get to see this beauty in all of its glory uh so it does look very interesting and i feel like this is uh i'm not really sure okay first of all i have to say the leg textures are incredible like there's no denying that and of course the face is very powerful as well which is exactly what i like to get out of the emu however some of my kind of like colleagues in the modding community have kind of expressed how the kind of front breast of it isn't as fluffy as it should be or kind of scraggly uh but it does look very interesting um it, it makes me kind of dizzy looking at it because of all those stripes in there uh emus are very difficult to get right when you're trying to model them it's uh i don't blame frontier for not getting this absolutely 100 percent perfect uh because no one really can it's a very difficult animal uh, but that's really just my two cents on it. I just can't get over those legs. It looks really good. And again, we got another view at some of the grass in here as well. Uh, grasses, plants, all this new jazz. Uh, there's some old ones in here, and I think there's some new ones too. Uh, I'm specifically looking at those kind of purple grasses in the back a little bit. Uh, and yeah, that really seems to be it. I'm not sure if that's some new grass up like towards the rear leg of the emu as well but i don't know i just i'm super excited for all of that another thing i did want to touch on as well is the kind of striped hyena debate again i'm gonna show another picture of this guy over here it seems like this guy is taking the community by storm it seems like a lot of people feel very strongly about it a lot of people aren't happy about it but some people are again I'm not really sure how to feel about this animal until we actually do get to see it in-game. So let's just keep our eyes posted for that relatively soon in the future. Uh, we also have a few more animal reveals to get through. We also have the Blue Wildebeest, which I am very excited to see. Uh, I'm not really the biggest fan of hoofstock, but the Blue Wildebeest is, of course, one of my favorite animals. In terms of hoofstock, at least, so that's going to be very cool to see. Uh, the armadillo, I'm not sure if I said that yet. Uh, and of course, a main wolf, if we could get a better look at the guy, I'd be very excited to see that. But thank you guys so much for watching, I really do appreciate it. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this, be sure to drop a little bit of a like, it always does go such a long way of helping me out. But I guess I will leave it there. Thank you all so much for stopping by, and I hope you all have the most wonderful of wonderful days. Take care, and bye bye now.